There are many medicinal herbs, of course, that have all sorts of amazing healing properties for wounds and other um, inflammatory types of problems. But the leaves of this particular herb, which is really a commonly found weed, are quite incredible wound healing remedies that have been used for centuries in almost all parts of the world and in the treatment of a number of diseases apart just from wounds. Now these include diseases related to skin, respiratory, digestive, um, for pain relief and also against infections. Now externally this herb is anti-inflammatory and antimicrobial and can stop itching and speed up healing. So what is this clever weed? Well stay tuned to learn more. Hi there, Lindor Pynchon, canine naturopath from Canine Vitality, and welcome to my channel, Happy Healthy Dogs, where it's my passion to help you help your dog live a longer, healthier life naturally. Guys, I appreciate you being here as always. Thank you very much. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and to click on the little bell to be notified of all my upcoming videos. So what on earth am I talking about? Well, plantain or plantago major is this incredible healing herb. Now, please don't confuse this herb with the banana-like fruit, which has the same name. They're not related. Now, plantain is native to North America, Europe, and parts of Asia, and it's the leaf that's used medicinally. Now, in these parts of the world where it's found, it's often just growing as a weed along the roadside or maybe in a backyard. So what are the benefits of this humble herb? Now, firstly, does your dog suffer from digestive disorders of any kind? Now, plantain contains a natural substance known as psyllium husks. Now, psyllium comes in contact with water within that digestive system, and it can create what's known as mucilage, which helps reduce and soothe down inflammation in the gut. Now, plantain also works to balance out both diarrhea and constipation as it contains this natural fiber. And along the same lines, if your dog's eaten something that they shouldn't, plantain can really help the body to pass this through as it provides this protective coating on the mucosal lining, which helps make things slip through more easily. Now in this way, it's a little bit like gut healing, the gut healing herb Slippery Elm, which some of you might also have heard about. Think of it as a lubricator, putting a healing coat on mucous membranes really anywhere in the body, including the urinary and respiratory systems. Now, does your dog ever suffer from urinary tract infections? The anti-inflammatory properties that are found within plantain have the ability to reduce pro-inflammatory immune cells known as cytokines. Uh, and this, of course, reduces the incidence of kidney, bladder and other infections um, in that area. Now, what about kennel cough and other respiratory coughs? You know, irrit irritating wet or dry coughs associated with kennel cough, bronchitis and other respiratory infections respond really well to plantain due to that high mucilage content I mentioned earlier. And this is such a soothing substance, which also provides moisture to the respiratory areas, reducing the spasms that lead to coughing, relaxing that area too. And of course, it will help reduce the inflammation that comes with any infection or allergy cough or sore throat. And finally, plantain contains an amazing ingredient known as allantoin, which promotes cell proliferation, stimulating new cell growth. Now, allantoin is also anti-inflammatory, which can help reduce swelling in case of injuries in your dog. And it also helps moisturize, soften and soften your dog's skin, preventing drying and irritation. So it really makes it perfect for those dogs that have a sensitive skin. It's really rich in antioxidants and this helps protect the skin and other tissues. And as allantoin is really helpful for wound healing in particular, it can be used as a washer in a cream or ointment form to speed up wound healing and reduce that swelling. And as I said earlier as well, uh, it's great for those itchy skin, uh, the itchy skin that's associated with the dry um, dryness that comes with any sort of skin irritation. So overall plantain is really, uh, you know, quite an incredible healing herb. It has all these properties that help reduce inflammation, protect tissues from damage, soothe and buffer areas, and also speed up wound healing, provide antioxidant support and so on. So it really is a fantastic herb. And it's also particularly helpful in cases of leaky gut syndrome, which you know I always talk about. Now, 
plantain sorry just not my camera plantain is now featuring in my gut buster uh, leaky gut remedy i've just started adding it in it's been quite hard for me to source this herb but i've finally been able to get some and it's going to be um, improving that overall formula so in terms of leaky gut it actually does buffer the damaged lining that um, occurs in leaky gut which starts to allow a lot of that undigested food and other particles to go through into the bloodstream so plantain can actually put almost like a sealing uh, a sealant on that um, digestive lining there to prevent a lot of that uh, food and other foreign particles to pass through into the bloodstream so and quite an amazing herb now guys if you want to find out a little bit more about plantain plantain um, please feel free to contact me I'll leave all my details in the description below and I'll also link to that gut buster formula if you'd like to find out a little bit more about that if you've got a dog with any issue that does involve inflammation wounds uh, any sort of respiratory urinary tract or digestive problem that you'd like to find out if plantain might be beneficial for your dog then please feel free to reach out to me or just comment below and I'll get back to you that way um, I hope you enjoyed this short video just a short one today um, if you did please give it a thumbs up and once again don't forget to subscribe to the channel I do appreciate your support and guys I hope you have a really good day looking forward to catching up with you in yet another video so I will talk to you very soon bye for now